Okay, so let's say we have um, a circle equation that's given to us that's x squared plus uh, 3x plus y squared uh, minus 5y uh, plus 3 is equal to 0. Actually, let's, uh, let's change this slightly. Let's say that this is plus 1. Okay? So I'm going to change the question slightly. Right? So this is the equation of the circle. And now I'm being asked, right, find me the coordinates of the centre and find me the radius of the circle. So what I'm going to do is I am going to complete the square on the two parts, the x's and the y's. So I'm going to have x plus 3 over 2 squared, take away 9 quarters, because I've squared top and bottom. And then for this part, I'm going to have y minus 5 halves squared, take away 25 over 4, square and top and bottom. And then I've got this plus 1. And the plus 1, because I want to make sure that everything has the same uh, denominator and is easy to add together and combine, I'm going to write the 1 as 4 over 4. So I'm preempting that because I know I've got a fraction with the denominator 4 there and a fraction with the denominator 4 there. So now I'm going to write those two brackets next to one another and deal with the other bits, these three other bits. So I've got minus 9 take away 25, so that's minus 34, then I've got to add 4, so that's minus 30, so we've got minus 30 over 4, which I'm then going to add to the other side, so I'm going to add 30 over 4 to both sides, and that gives me this. Okay, perfectly well, that's fine. Now 30 over 4, that can be simplified, okay, so 30 over 4 is 15 over 2, So that means that the centre of this circle is at minus 3 halves, 5 halves, and the radius is equal to the square root of 15 over 2. Okay, so the square root of 15 over 2, which you could simplify if you like, um, let's say that square root of 15 over the square root of 2, and so I can multiply top and bottom by root 2. So I'm going to get root 30 on the top, 2 on the bottom, so I could just write that as 1 half root 30 if I like. Okay, and that would be fine. So this is how you can go from a uh, equation of a circle to find the centre and radius, and it's a slightly more fiddly problem because you're ending up with fractions.